Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Mind Pump TV. All right, so one of the biggest problems people have with trying to get a fit, strong body is lack of equipment. Now we've done videos where you can do a full workout without any equipment whatsoever. But what I wanna do today is I wanna show you how to do a full effective workout with just a pair of dumbbells, that's it. With just one pair of dumbbells, you can train your entire body. So what I'm gonna show you today is the best exercises for each major muscle group. I'm gonna show you an exercise for your legs, for your back, for your chest, for your shoulders, for your biceps and your triceps, all right? Let's do this. All right, so the first exercise, we're gonna work the lower body, the legs. So when you start this workout, we wanna start with the biggest muscle groups first, when you have the most energy, the most strength, um, and that is the, the legs. We're gonna do walking lunges. I love lunges almost as much or maybe as much as I love squats. You know, being able to squat down in this split stance is very important for the lower body. We've got the, the pelvis is in a different position. One leg is behind, one leg is in front, and it mimics more, calm, or it, it more closely mimics walking or running, which is what you do with your legs mostly. Anyway, great lower body builder. So we're gonna take dumbbells, hold them at our sides for added resistance. You wanna take a big step forward, but what you don't wanna do is you don't wanna line your feet up. If my feet line up, I'll lose my balance. So you wanna step forward and out a little bit. So I'm gonna step out here just a little bit. Up on my toes on the back leg, I'm gonna bring my knee down and then I'm gonna step forward, bring my feet together and then step forward with the left leg so I can alternate. Same thing, back foot up on the toes, bring that knee down and then step forward and together and repeat, walking lunges. All right, so the next exercise is for the back. That's the next biggest muscle group. We're gonna do dumbbell rows, works out all the muscles of the back, also helps correct your posture. So you wanna take your both, both your dumbbells and you wanna bend over with good posture. So notice how I'm not rounded like this. My chest is forward, my core is tight. You wanna pull the dumbbells up and you wanna squeeze the shoulders back and stick the chest out and come right back down. What you don't wanna do is you don't wanna row with your shoulders forward like this. You wanna actually pull the shoulders back and squeeze. Otherwise you'll give yourself worse posture, which is what we don't want. So again, here's your row and then all the way down. All right, the next exercise, dumbbell chest press. This works the shoulders, the triceps, but the main muscle is the chest. That's why they call it a chest press. So you wanna take both dumbbells, you wanna lay back on your back, you wanna bring your elbows out, keep your hands on top of your elbows so you don't want them in like this and you don't want them out like that. You wanna keep the hands on top of the elbows. Chest high, shoulders pinned down and back, hips on the floor, feet on the floor, press up, Allow the dumbbells to come together a little bit, then bring them back down, but make sure to keep those hands on top of the elbows. So this is the tempo that you wanna copy. Okay. So the next exercise, good old fashioned shoulder press. I want your hands on top of your elbows again, just like we did with the chest press, elbows out, good posture. This is about as low as you wanna go with this particular positioning, and you're gonna press them up and together, down and apart. This is the tempo that you wanna maintain. Now make sure, to, make sure to keep a tight core and make sure your arms come straight up and you're not leaning back to try to press the dumbbells up. You want a nice tall posture when you're doing this exercise. All right, so the next exercise is for the biceps. We're gonna do another basic effective exercise. You wanna take both dumbbells in each hand. You wanna stand with good posture and you wanna curl one at a time. Now notice when I bring the dumbbell up, I turn my hand so that it faces up. That's called supination. You wanna alternate the dumbbell. So wait till one goes all the way down before you curl the other one. This is the tempo you wanna maintain with this exercise. The final exercise is for the back of the arms, the tricep. With this one, you only need one dumbbell. You wanna grab the top of the dumbbell like so, arms straight up above your head, bend the elbows only so you can extend the elbow and then squeeze the tricep. Again, you're gonna bend the elbow, extend the elbow, and squeeze the tricep. This is a great tricep exercise. This is your tempo. All right, so I just showed you a basic total body workout with just dumbbells. Now here's how I want you to put that all together. Do the exercises in the order that I taught you, first of all, so you're gonna do your lunges, then you're gonna do your rows, your chest press, your shoulder presses, then your bicep curls, and your tricep extension. But here's how you're gonna do them. 
I want you to do between eight to 12 reps uh, for each exercise, and I want you to do three sets before you move to the next exercise. So in other words, the first exercise is walking lunges. Do your walking lunges, make sure you get eight to 12 reps on either leg, so not total, but on either leg, on both legs. Then you're gonna rest for about 60 seconds, so about a minute, catch your breath, let yourself rest a little bit. Now this is important, by the way, you wanna do the rest because we're trying to build muscle and build strength and speed up your metabolism. So you're not trying to go from exercise to exercise, otherwise you're just doing cardio with weights and that's not what we're trying to do here. We're trying to build, sculpt, and speed up the metabolism. So you do your set, eight to 12 reps, rest for about a minute, then do another set, then rest for about a minute, and then do your final set, and then move to the next exercise. So three sets, eight to 12 reps of each exercise, do them in that order. You should do this workout about three times a week, especially if you're a beginner, three times a week, this workout with just dumbbells, you should actually see some pretty darn good results. If you have any questions at all, put in the comments below. I'll make sure to visit periodically to answer those questions for you. Also, share this video with your friends. Maybe you guys can do this workout together. And finally, subscribe to this channel and set on your notifications so you can see when we post new videos.